Uh, Will and... Uh, I'm Blake. Blake. Blake, Blake and Will. Okay, yeah, excellent. Yeah, yeah. We're going to be looking right here, gentlemen. All right. All right. Once again, Survival Radio Network. Uh, we're here live on the red carpet of the 40th anniversary of the Atlanta Film Festival. Everybody Wants Some by Richard Blake Lanner. One of my favorite actors. How I mean, producers and directors. How was it working with this amazing Hall of Famer from Texas? Uh, it was it was pretty incredible. It was pretty incredible. You know, Richard Linklater is sort of a is the grandfather of Texas film in a way. So to be able to be a part of his movies, and, you know, having grown up watching his work, uh, was really is really an honor. You know, and Rick is such a generous, nice, uh, humble guy. It's just uh, you feel like a sponge around him. You just want to soak up as much wisdom and knowledge from him as you can. I was going to say, it seems like the type of director that would be an actor's director. Oh, 100 percent. We were we were we were approaching this whole project kind of like theater you know we went in we were drilling this for you know the script and the baseball practices and the dance rehearsals for like two and a half weeks straight wow so yeah, yeah. how long did it take to film this um well like, with rehearsals and everything i'd say close to three months yeah, yeah. can yeah. you tell, tell us a little bit about your characters individually? Yeah. sure sure i play um billy autry uh, who's a freshman pitcher on this baseball team. He comes in, he's a uh, country boy with kind of humble backgrounds, and the rest of the guys give him a hard time because he's in love with his girlfriend back home. He's not really that good at coping with this whole new college situation. And sweet. cool enough, Blake and I are actually roommates in the yeah. movie. Yeah. Sweet, sweet, yeah. sweet, the freshman. Yeah. yeah. All right, sweet. Yeah, I'm in the same boat as him, freshman pitcher from my small town. I think I'm coming in confident, knowing that I was a top dog at my old school, right. getting knocked back to square one the second I get there by the seniors. So I'm just going on on this whole ride over these three days kind of finding myself and finding my niche in this whole this big world with all the music that's being thrown around yeah. and all the all the teammates that I meet over the course of the three days so now, of course neither one of you gentlemen actually ever experienced that in your real life right no <laughs> well no, I mean, not really you, you, you had know the college experience. that's sort of like the dream college experience you know my college experience was great it was it was fantastic but it wasn't anything as crazy as what we have in this movie well, yeah. we gotta let you go gentlemen thank sure, you so yeah. very much